Hello, my posse. Hello, all my new subscribers. Oh my goodness, thank you so much for joining my channel. I so appreciate you. Thank you for coming into my living room. Uh, I love having you here. It's just, it's just an honor that you come to my house. I'm just so excited. Anyway, today, you know, is the infamous Get Ready With Me. Mm, you know how I love to do these Get Ready With Me's, girls. When I first started YouTube, I, I probably already mentioned it, um, I said nobody would ever see me without makeup. <laughs> No, I don't even go to the mailbox without makeup. Um, I do now, occasionally, because my canvas is good. But um, I do it for you because I know you love it. And today I'm doing it for you, too, to show, tell you about this new product, Fiera. It's a new product to me that I've discovered, and I absolutely love it. And if you want to see how I got this beautiful, soft, glowing, youthful, anti-aging, collagen hyaluronic acid infused look you want to stay tuned for my get ready with me so i appreciate you coming i i hope that you hang around to the end and um i just like you when you hang around to the end don't fast forward me don't fast forward me there's there's a burn button on there it'll burn the tip of your fingers <laughs> anyway i do appreciate you and um so we'll talk about how i got this look and do our get ready with me and thank you so much for coming. I appreciate you. I'll be right back. Ah! <sighs> so here I am. No shame, no gain. Is that right? I don't know. You know, I, I, I never thought in a million years that I would do a get ready with me in front of anybody without my makeup on. And here I am in front of... 7,000 something subscribers, if you're all watching me, uh, with no makeup on. And uh, I'm in front of my bright light, my bright window in the back. I look a little pale, but it's just because I steamed my face. I put, I ice cubed my face and I put all my uh, moisturizers on. I am doing this today and my hair is curly. I really just kind of got out of the shower a bit ago, but I'm doing this today um to demonstrate to you as promised this fiera oops it's called luxury concealer and it is hold on ah. glasses are glared today because the sun's directly on me it's a hyaluronic acid with collagen i ordered the medium i also have one uh, that I bought the first time uh, in neutral beige. And um, some of you would love the neutral beige. It's a little too light for me. And oh my gosh, does it glow. It's a really, I mean, it's really glowing. And I, and I got to tell you, if Nanny, Nanny, if you're watching me, Nanny and the Moose, you'll, you love to glow. You will love this concealer because you don't like to wear a lot of makeup. She doesn't like to wear a lot of makeup. She doesn't wear it all the time. This isn't really considered a, a foundation. It's actually listed as a concealer, but um, the demos showed as you can use it lightly on your face. It's very light on your face. It's full coverage, but it's so light on your face. It's just, it's like you have no makeup on. And um, I'll do the pros and cons on it because Jackie from upstate New York, she loves the pros and the cons. So I will give you my pros and cons on it when I put it on. But let me tell you a little bit about it first. <laughs> hey, David, dog. Like, I want to just get right to the glamour part. But, but I'm like a little kid in the morning when I get up. I love the transformation, even on myself. You know, I used to, I told you about my story about my grandma and, and when I worked in the salon and when I sold Mary Kay and the transformations on people. But I love the transformation. <laughs> myself and I always laugh at my husband I go look at the transformation you got so we always kind of laugh about it and then I told you my grandson <laughs> I had my phone one day and my phone was off and he said do you have a password and I, and I look like this and I said yeah I have a password he said it's a good thing because your phone wouldn't recognize you with your face ID and I was like that's a mean thing to say, but I laugh because it's probably true, but it does. Anyway, so on to the uh, Fiera Luxury Concealer. Here's what it says. 89% of you women do not know about this product, so I'm going to give it to you straightforward. Um, it's strong enough to cover 
under eye bags and you know I have an under eye bag here I have this vein that popped up since my cataract surgery it is what it is I think primer might take it off but I don't think it would doesn't matter uh, and um, it covers age spots I do not have age spots but it does cover a, a lot of uh, discoloration I have discoloration as you can see in my skin I have bad dark circles and since I've been sick oh my gosh I have been battling these dark circles but I have a lot of discoloration in my skin I am mean I'm 79 so I'm gonna have something I mean you know uh, and I don't I don't have a whole lot of wrinkles uh, but you know they're there a little but um tight Jack what was I gonna say oh uh, but they do cover age spots and they say that they they do and it's it really is amazing stuff uh it minimizes pores and fine lines it does um especially for women over 40 this is magnificent if you want to glow and some of you like to glow this is the one for you it's full coverage actually but it's light uh it fights the signs of aging by using anti-aging ingredients so the ingredients in this little teeny weeny tube like this that you think why would i pay 39.99 for that little tube a little goes a long ways and i'll show you in a second but it's hyaluronic acid which keeps um keeps your skin uh hydrated and and helps with wrinkles it has collagen in it which helps to improve dry damaged skin which you all know collagen does uh, it's got something called haloxyl, which I have no idea, but it helps reduce dark circles, which it really does. And since I've been using it like daily, I think that my dark circles have lightened up a little bit. Um, at least when I use this, it does. I still kind of need my concealer. I'm just kind of hooked on a whiter look under the eye. But anyway, uh, enough of that right now and it's got lecithin in it which restores moisture and promotes healing which is really i mean everything in this one tiny little tube i mean hello so i'm all moisturized i haven't really discovered what how i like to put it on yet they give you and it's and it's also buy two um buy two you can buy two mediums and you can try the natural beige which i'm sure nanny would love this one um so 39.99 each you buy two you get one free and they send you um the free brush i don't know if i like putting it on with this brush but let's just start it and see and i'll show you the coverage it's it's absolutely phenomenal it's very thick um texture hold on i've been using this for like three weeks now off and on so i just squirted out a little bit like so so we'll start out on this side of my face. I guess I'll use my mirror here. We'll start out here and I'll just, I'll put it on with a brush just to show you the coverage. It goes under the eye. You can see the dark circles disappearing and I'm all primed and everything. So it's good. So this is how you know they recommend you putting it on now you can put it on like this it comes with the free brush i'll do this side of my face hold on and you'll see the difference oops so hold on that is one side of my face done can you see that really the finish on it is beautiful i usually like to take a damp sponge and go over it blend it down always into my neck which is hard to do with this little brush so i think it's like you can see how it covers <laughs> uh, under my eyes so let's put it on the other side and then we'll discuss it. Hold on. Okay. That is very soft, smooth, and I think it covers the discoloration 
in your skin. It's smooth. I always forget to do this in this. When I edit it, I always see this little Munster thing here and under my nose. <laughs> anyway, so I think, I think my dark circles, I think it works really well. But the coverage, and you saw the little squirt that I used, and it went on my face, I think, beautifully. It, uh, it, it's not tacky. It's a little bit till it dries. But it's not too bad. Now I'll show you. I'll show you the light one under this eye. This one is natural beige. I was just going to put it under one eye because um, the cons for me on this, it's too much highlight under my eyes. Uh, like I say, Nanny, you would love this because you're a glow girl and you want a soft look under your eyes. When I hit the sunlight, direct sunlight, under my eyes, it's just too glowy for me. That's about my cons on this. It's just, I'm used to a matte finish. I don't like to highlight anything on my face, but oh my gosh, girls, it's absolutely, <laughs> it's it's so worth every $39.95. I mean, it's just, my face feels like I'm natural. Like I could probably go out like this uh, with a wig on and, and be perfectly happy. I think it's just a beautiful finish. It feels very lightweight and I love it. And I really think, you know, you can use the Glow 25. It's it's still uh, buy two, get one free, and you can get 25% off of that uh, total. And I'm very... I'm shocked. I, I, it feels so good on your skin, and I am really happy, happy with the coverage on it. I just think it's just, you can see, even in the sun, you can see how, how I'm glowing. So I, that's what I wanted to show you. And now we'll just do a really quick, I think, get ready with me, and I'll just finish up because I'm actually going on a date tonight. Oh, yeah, with my husband. He's been working so hard taking care of me and my leg and me just vegetating on the couch. I told him tonight, I'm taking him out for Mexican food. So I'm going on a date. So I'm going to, I'm going to be a hotty toddy in my, uh, little overdo it on my shadow today. Cause I am going out on a date. Uh, so we're going to go in with this. This is the, um, Tartelet eyeshadow. And this is by Juicy Tart. I love this one. It's, uh, I've used it a lot. Natalie, the, the beauty diva, uses it. You can see which ones that I use the most. I do not know what the colors are. There's a lot of, uh, you know, the highlight glossy ones here. I'm not a lover of even my eyelids glossing. Although those bumps in my eyelids that I told you about with using the Ella Frida um, hyaluronic acid with a retinol moisturizer at night, uh, dabbing them on the, my eyelids, my eyelids. <laughs> bumps have gone significantly significantly uh, down. And I mean, I, I can't help the creasiness, although this stuff really doesn't really show your creasiness in your eyelids. Can you see that? I mean, yeah, when I smile, I guess, but I will be 80 on my next birthday, so there's smile lines. I've earned them. <laughs> anyway, so let's try a little bit of this. Uh, I'm going to use... Um, I'm going to use this uh, dark brownish one here. I'm not really sure what color that is. I lost a little paper on it, but it's the tart and it's the juicy palette. So we're going to try this and I'm going to hold my brush way down here because I've discovered that when I hold my brush up here, I get too much uh, d coverage on it. And I found out when I start over here, it works out better because by the time I get here, it's, it's a little lighter. So we'll do this and uh, see what we get. All right, every time I edit this or I go afterwards, I always, my shadow's always wonky, but uh, I love this. Uh, has has a little bit of fallout. That's a cons on this palette, this juicy palette. It does have fallout, and I'm one that keeps forgetting to bang on my 
you get the fallout off my brush and then I end up here and then it gets all done here. But sometimes what I wanna do, just another color because I am a cranberry lover. This one is glossy, which I don't love. I'll just zap it up here, just a stripe, like so, as you can see, just a stripe and a stripe. And then I'll get my Sigma brush, Sigma, Sigma brush, and I will blend that in. That's a really pretty color for me. I, I, I really like me in cranberries. I think it's just a really pretty color for me. And it's not harsh, it's not dark, and it's, uh, it's just really pretty. So I think I'll go in here, uh, this color here. I don't know what it is, girls, I'm sorry. By the, by the Juicy Palette, you'll, you'll see what it is. This is the one in the middle on the right <laughs> or left, depending on how you're looking at it. And we're just gonna tap the center. Like so. Well, sometimes I get more on this side than this side. I'll see it in editing when I'm all done. But that's a really pretty color. It's kind of pinkish um, in cranberries and they go really nice. Now, if I wanted to pop some sparkle in there, I'll use this top one and pop just a little bit of sparkle so I can do that. And it's, see how it opens up your eyes really good. So I think that's pretty. I mean, I, I'm going out tonight. I think that's good. I think on the, yeah, the bottom, I love the way Heidi Klum um, does her eyes on the bottom. I love my eyelashes on the bottom with mascara on them. And I love the line on the bottom. That's just me. And we're gonna go into this one that you can see I'm panned out on. And we're going to lightly, oh, tap, tap, Babs. Uh, go on the bottom lash. I just love a lot of that on my bottom l l lashes. Go up a little bit if you wanted to. And if you wanted to just fill this in a little bit on the corner, we can dab that just a little. Like so, what a beautiful, um, a beautiful, beautiful texture that this little tube can give you. You won't even know that you're wearing makeup. It's absolutely, absolutely beautiful. And like I say, the cons for me on it, which wouldn't be for you, and I know Nanny would love it, is the fact that it glows. And you know, if you're dry um, and you wanna, you like that glow, if you look at your skin and your skin is kind of gray and dull um, and you wanna glow more, but you don't wanna look greasy, you would love this because it definitely, definitely, definitely glows. Your skin looks extremely, your skin looks extremely hydrated. I still like, even though it covers good, this, this is my bad eye, the bad guy. Uh, but I still want my, my own, a little bit of my own uh, concealer on, which I'll get in a second. But we're gonna put some blush on, you know I'm the blush queen. And I could put, you could put powder. I put powder on this because I like a more matte, finish, but you really don't need powder. I think when I've seen the demos on their website and stuff, I don't think the girls use powder because you want that moisture. You want that glow. And I'll tell you, I've been out at football games all day and out outside with this on and it stays put all day with or without powder. So we're going to just do, um, this one here is called bright pink and this is by elf. I love, I love this one. You can tell it's down the pan. And I looked for it at Walmart the other day and I didn't see it. So, and this brush I love. So we do the blush, I always do my nose. A little bit down your neck. 
So that's pretty much it for foundation. I mean, we talked and I put it on, but it takes no time at all. And look at my skin and my Rudolph nose. Wow, Babsy, what's wrong with you, girl? Christmas is around the corner, Rudolph. But anyway, uh, it's beautiful. I mean, I can't really say enough good things about this product. I think you will really love it. If you like a moisture look and something that looks natural, like you I, you saw me before, even without putting anything else on, you could actually go out like that and not have your age spots or your discoloration showing where you know, you're know you embarrassed or your dark circles and you wanna just run to the store. You can just flop that all over your face and you're good to go. It's beautiful. Nobody would even know. I don't think that it's a makeup a foundation on your face. So I'm gonna do a little bit under the eye. I'm gonna curl my lashes and I am going to put on my e.l.f. Big, what is this called? Big Mood. I called it Big Moose before, but it's Big Mood. I'll put on my, cause nothing's complete until your mascara's on. So I think that's all I'm gonna put on as far as my eyeshadow goes. I don't think I want any more color. I could put another little dab in the center of the glitter. One. Like so, and that's it. And of course you all know I do absolutely nothing to my eyebrows. I had to pluck the gray ones out the other day. Man, I had one here. It was hanging, I think, down to the end of my... <laughs> I kept thinking, what's in my eye? What's in my eye? And I looked and I have this gray eyebrow. Well, it wasn't that long, but I exaggerate for, for humor. But yeah, it was pretty It was pretty long. So let me go and curl my eyelashes, put my mascara on, then I'll show you. And then I'll end like I started. Hold on. Add my uh, e.l.f. concealer to this just because I... I don't love the glow. It's beautiful coverage. You'll love the glow. I personally don't want to glow under the eyes. Also, if you take your concealer and you go up to the side, it's almost like a mini lift little trick. Little TikTok trick. I'm just going to pat that in. Like so. I am going to powder this out of this e.l.f. powder here, just this tiny one. I think this one here is for under your eyes or whatever, but I'm going to just Take down the gloss a little bit for me. Glow, little glow worm, glimmer, glimmer. La, da, 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 da. And I am pretty much done. Now I'm gonna go put my wig on and get ready for my date and you'll see me at the end, how I looked in the beginning. But really and truly, girls, don't be afraid to try this. I definitely would refer this to you. Honest opinion, I absolutely love it. The pros on it, it is, um, cover, the coverage is amazing. It's hydrating. I can feel, I can feel my skin plumping. I can feel the hydration in my skin. I can feel uh, it, it really helps your wrinkles. You bring it all the way down into your neck. Uh, it's just um, amazing. And um, I still like my concealer, my e.l.f. concealer under my eyes, even though this is a very good coverage and I'm sure it would be an excellent coverage for you. But for me, I think it's a little bit too glossy, too highlighting um, for, for, for my taste. Not because it doesn't look good, it does. I just I don't like to highlight. I don't like to glow that much. I glow from the inside out. But that's my only con, and that's just me. That's not you, because probably 90% of you want to glow. I like a more matte finish. So uh, I'll be right back. Mm -hmm. Ta-da! The only thing I forgot in the end of my get ready with me is to put my lipstick on before I got all pizzazz with my wig. And of course, it's the e.l.f., and is the uh, flirtatious and it's uh, 7710 and I know you all asked me about this but anyway um, and I forgot to put my little 
necklace on that my husband just fixed for me. My little um, kiss that I wear all the time. So I think I probably have too much blush, but I love blush. But I think my glasses aren't glaring too much because the sun's kind of down a little bit on that window, not too bad. But I think it's a beautiful finish, girls. I think it's just uh, worth, uh, worth an investment for you, worth it to try it. I don't really think that you'll be sorry. I, I'm really, really impressed with the luxury concealer. I guess it should say concealer slash foundation and uh, Glow 25, and you can get 25% off of that. And I think my skin looks amazing. And I don't have a filter. I'm only in front of a, a big picture window here. So I don't want you saying, well, you look good because you have a filter. I wouldn't even know how to put a filter on my iPhone. I do it from this older iPhone. I wouldn't even know how to put a filter on here. So this is me in front of my big sunny window. And I, as you can see, the coverage is beautiful, and I love that palette. So I hope you like my Get Ready With Me. I know you do. You love my Get Readies With Me. And that's what the, some of the things I've used. I've shown you the, the Tartalette palette. I've used it all the time. I love it. The e.l.f. mascara, I love it. But the main thing I did the Get Ready With Me for today was the Fiera, and I absolutely love it. Uh, so thank you for coming. I, I know you love my Get Ready With Me. Aren't they great? I mean, the transformations are amazing and I think anybody can look the best and be the best version of themselves with just a little fuss and fluff and of course you know before you do that your canvas has to be good you have to work your canvas I did my gua sha and my lymphatic drainage this morning I do that every day and if at night too when I wash my face I do it at night when I'm sitting sometimes watching TV I love it I love it it's like such therapy for me so I will update you uh coming up on my um leg my condition um, I'm starting PT on Monday. I don't need surgery, so that's a good thing. So thank you for all your concerns, all your emails, all your love, all your prayers. I so appreciate you, um, and I'll keep you posted. So thanks for coming by today, girls. I so appreciate you. You know I appreciate you. I love you, and thank you to all my new subscribers who have joined my posse. Uh, we so love you and uh, so appreciate you for coming over. And if you haven't already subscribed, just you know hit the subscribe button. I know there's like 44% of you that watch me that haven't subscribed. I mean, hit the subscribe button. It's free. It really is. It's a free, it's a free show for you. <laughs> so anyway, thank you for coming. And remember, be the eye in kind. We all need it. The whole world needs it. Thank you. I love you. I'll see you again real soon. Bye-bye.